Hello everyone, welcome back to another video on the YouTube channel and in this video I'm going to show you guys the 5 best aquarium designs for any type of build. So with that said, let's show you the designs. So the first design we have here is definitely the most basic design. It is basically just a normal aquarium with some accents on the top of and bottom filled with spruce. Um, the second design we have here is definitely a bit more interesting with a specially shaped aquarium and it has like a cool extra design around it which I think is very nice. Um, for the third design we have it's basically very wide so if your build is not that tall but you still really want like a nice aquarium that can take up a lot of empty space on your wall definitely consider using this one. Um, then we have two ones that you can build at any height. I really like this first one because one it's very small because you can just basically put it anywhere on your wall you could put it like down at the bottom like on the floor here but you could also just put it like way high up or just somewhere in the corner of your house you can basically put it anywhere the same goes for this one although this one is a bit bigger so you would need to be a bit more careful in consideration of the space we would want to put this one and with that all said, let's get right into how to make these designs. Let's starting with the first one. So for the first one, what you want to do is you want to punch out six blocks just like this. Now you want to get yourself strip spruce logs and put them down at the bottom. And now you can replace these three blocks with sand, just like that. Now what you want to do is you want to put sand stained glass, just like that. And basically we already have the aquarium. Now we only need the top accent, like that, with the, oak with the spruce trapdoors, and you want to fill it with water. Just fill it up with some water buckets. And um, I really recommend always adding in like a sea pickle or two. It really lights it up a bit and fill it with fishies. And there we have it. That is our first design for today. It's definitely very simple. And as you can see, we can actually see the inside of the aquarium quite decently well. I think that's only the case because of the sea pickles there, otherwise it would be way too dark in there. But with that said, let's get right into our second design, which is this one. So for a second design today, you want to start off by placing the three upside down spruce stairs, counting three blocks up, just like that, and then placing another line of spruce stairs, just like that. Now what you want to do is you want to place a strip spruce log right here, and in the opposite corner, right there. Now what you want to do is you want to punch out these blocks that are in the middle and you want to cover it a sign stained glass, just like we're doing right now. Now what you want to do is you want to get back your spruce trap door that I just put away and I want to put them on the sides here, just like that, just build her up. There we go, and now do the same thing for the opposite side as well. Oop, I am very smart. There we go, just like that. And what you now can do is just fill up the aquarium. Just let me do that real quick. And there you go. I basically did it the same way I did this one. And I think that the second design looks very nice like this. So let's get on with the third design, the very long one. So I really think that this third design is really interesting as you can make it as long as you want and you can fill up any empty space in your base. So let's start by making it. First put the stair like this, put an upside down stair right above it like that so you have this weird like backwards C shape now put down a upside down spruce there just like that and uh, put two spruce slab right beside it now put another up down, upside down spruce there here and put again the C shape just like we did on the other side now what you want to do is you want to put science stained glass in the middle here and you want to cover it with some spruce trap doors there we go and now it's time to make the aquarium thing behind it again. And there we go. That is our third design for today. So now let's get on to our smallest aquarium. The one you can, that you can basically base anywhere like it's a painting. So what you want to do for a fourth design is basically the only things you need to do is put an upside down stair. And basically put your sign stained glass right on top of it. Now put a normal spruce stairs on top of that. And put your spruce trap doors on the sides just like you did with this one but basically on a smaller scale. There we go. Oop. And only the last one at the bottom. Um, I can't really put a sea pickle and a, a fish in there, but alternatively what you could do is just place a sea lantern 
um, right behind it, so you don't have to use a sea pickle in there. And now for our last design of today, we're gonna make this one, which is also pretty intricate, and it's like pretty interesting. I think it could look very cool in some like steampunk style builds, so let's get right into making it. So first you want to start off by placing down three spruce trap doors and placing two stairs just like this. Just like this. And you basically want to mirror this above it. So you want to do this and this and put some more trap doors just on top of that. Now what you want to do is you want to put these over here in the middle connecting the top and bottom sides and place your sign stained glass in the middle again and there you have it that's our last design for today so if you guys like these designs please consider liking and subscribing it really helps me out a ton please consider it and with that said i think i'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow bye bye